slip through the program with foundation kids. Okay? Have you ever heard of Sky? Huh? It's a drug. Uh, uh, we are not going to write like this. We are not writing. We are going to do hands on. You either do it hands on or you don't do it. We don't want anyone to write, okay? We're going to move around as we do step by step, okay? Yeah. It's a simple programming language. We don't need lines of code, we just need to plot and draw, okay? Now, I want everyone to close. Do close the special notes for your classroom. You want to start just after it. Close. If it's not there, let me go and look at the other. If you don't have, you can go to the other side and share. See that. That one can have. If you think, you can go behind there and share and make sure you see. Everyone has closed. Huh? Everyone, have you closed? Because I want us to start from scratch, from nothing, okay? Is everyone looking this side? Let us first look at the. So, there is this icon here. Just start on the start menu. Eh? Scratch. Okay, let me search for it here. It's there. It can come, eh? So, this is the scratch icon. Like, whenever you open scratch, whenever you want to open scratch, that is what you should look at, okay? Then I'm going to click on it. So now it is open, okay? So when you open it, it loads. There are blocks. Hmm? When you're programming with Scratch, you don't write lines of code, but you're doing blocks together, okay? Now, I want us, like whenever you open Scratch, you'll see a cat, okay? A cat is always there by default. So now, me, what I want to do is, I want to remove the cat. Is that okay? Then we are going to remove this card. We are going to delete it. Is that what I'm saying here? The deleting button. So I'm going to delete the card. The card has gone, okay? So the card has gone. Mm -hmm. Now here, is that what I'm saying here? Eh? Which one is there? Which is uh, saying? Which is Which one is that? Choose a sprite, okay? A sprite is something you program, okay? Even you can choose yourself. You can take yourself a photo and put it there. Yeah? A sprite is just something you're going to program, okay? Is it okay? <coughs> so now here we are going to choose a sprite. Let us take this. Let us take ballerina. Okay? But now, but the other size is very short. I want to increase the size. Is everyone seeing where I've clicked? Hmm? Has everyone seen where I've clicked? I want to increase ballerina's size to 200. Okay? Then when I tap there, when I tap here, ballerina has increased the size. Okay? So, um, I want everyone let us first look this side. You're going to do it on your own, okay? I'm going to tell you what I want. Let us first see how it works. Then you can do it, okay? Is it okay? Good children? Okay, now I want to get for ballerina a background. A backdrop. Eh? It's like a background. Now like that thing there. Eh? Is everyone seeing that in modern computer hardware? That background, eh? It's what I want, the background, something behind something, okay? So I'm going to look for a backdrop here. I think, let me take this one. Let me take ballerina is in the house, not so? Uh, now I want ballerina to, to, 
I want to set instructions. Programming, when I say programming, that means sets of instructions, okay? Now, like, what, like you students, a teacher is the one to program you what the teacher wants, okay? The teacher tells you, do this assignment. That means that teacher is programming you, okay? When I say programming, it's a set of instructions. A set of instructions. Okay. Now here we are going to we have put our sprites, we have put the backdrop. Now we are going to set instructions for the sprite, okay? Now we are going to go here in we are going to go here in events. Yeah? So now events, it is a flag. We are going to select drag and drop the flag. This one here is the flag, yeah? Because the flag helps us to run our programs whenever you click on the flag. Now here, when you see this flag, eh? Whenever you click on the flag, it runs, it selects your program to run, okay? Then when you click on the, on the red button, eh? It stops. Is it okay? So now here, after there, you want this girl to move. You want Valerina to move, okay? But I want her to move 10 steps. Then I'm going to go here in the, in the, that upper, I, this one, upper one, the upper blue icon, it's called the motion, yeah? So now I'm going to drag and draw, move 10 steps, okay? Move 10 steps. Then I'm going to click on the flag, okay? You see? But now, Valerina can't do what you want, okay? So now, what I need to do is, I'm going to go in there, in the, in the controls, eh? Then I say, I want to pick a, a control whereby it can go over and over. It's like called the loop, whereby you want something to go on and on and on, okay? We are setting for it instructions. Give the glow that someone who is in flow. So we are going to drag and drop this forever. Control. I'm going to put it here inside. I want to, I want the blue to be inside. Is it is everyone saying that? Yeah. Then when we click on our flag, that means ballerina has gone. Okay. But now I want ballerina to come back because we are setting instructions for ballerina, okay? Then we have to go here in loops, in, in the motions. Then we are going to look for the one which says that if, if on edge bounce back, okay? That it can come back. Hmm? Is that what I'm saying how it is coming back? But it's coming back in a wrong way, okay? And it's also going very fast. So I'm going to say, set, I'm going to set the rotation styles. Then this one here says this, set rotation style. Okay? But now I've set the rotation styles, but I have not reduced on the speed. On the speed, I want ballerina, I want our girl to move, okay? Then I'm going to go here in loops, and I say, I tell her to say something, and then wait a bit, okay? Huh? But now the two seconds are too much, okay? Now I want to reduce the seconds to 0 0.5. Huh? Is it okay? Okay, give me that one. It's very low. Let me put 1.5. Huh? Give me that one. It's low. Let us use the 0 0.1. Okay, but now it's still rushing so much. Okay, let us put it to one point five. Is it okay there? Okay, but now the word is that 
Matthew girl, what the what she's saying, you can edit it. Which school is that? Francis, are you mad? Okay. I'm going to say ICT club. On whatever you want, okay? So now they have finished that. Now but I want to check. It. But maximize it. Okay. Now I want to go to full screen. Is everyone seeing where my cursor is? Okay, I've gone to full screen. Huh? Okay, now after that, I want to change the next question because she's not moving, okay? You can't just move like this. Hmm? I want her to move, to walk, okay? And, but ballerina dances, okay? I want her to dance. So what I want to do next is I want to change her costume. When you want her to change the different styles, that means you say next costume okay so now when we go here is everyone seeing up here the first one is coats and the second one is costumes okay that means this different one thing yeah these ones that are the different costumes i need to change okay but now i need to write the code i need to drag and drop the code which does that okay so now the code is here in loops which says next costume okay then i have dragged and dropped next costume huh but now what i want else is the sound yeah i want sound so i'm going to go here in sounds is that what i'm saying sounds so now i want her to make <coughs> some sound as she's jumping Okay? Let me hope everyone has understood the sound part of it, okay? Yes. I want to go and I want us to make her to count. Teacher Nora. Yes. Maybe let them first end here, you see? They have been waiting for you. They are not at your stage. Let them first reach that step before you proceed. It's okay. Mm. So, <clears throat> the chords. Because you see, <clears throat> I think let us start you can now help them. So that you can pass when you're stuck, you call me. You can do it. You can do it. So we want to do a program that makes a girl to jump around in her room while saying ICT club in front of you. This is our program. That is the problem. So can we achieve that? I want the 
Is it working now? Then you put this cord. Don't bend your arm closer. Can't find it. Can't find it. Can't find it. Uh-huh. I say when you reach on, when you say, when you put the forever law and you say move 10 steps in, the next thing is you go into motions and look for a, a block which says if on edge bounce back, okay? If on edge bounce back. Drag and drop. You just hit drag and drop it in the forever law. Put it inside here. Mm -hmm. Put it in, just inside. Yeah. Uh -huh. But you must work on the side. I want it to be 200. Okay? If so here, on edge, bounce back. Rather drop it you here. Can, in our blocks. You can, you can delete if some of these. Emotions, eh? Click on this one to remove it. If you have put very many, click on this one. Let's remain in the one. Okay, if on edge, don't put it here. He says, if on edge, bounce back. So now, then after putting if on edge, bounce back. You set the rotation steps left, right, okay? Set the rotation steps left, right. Just, no, just drag and drop it. Let us not change it. And drop it there. Change, set, rotation. Click here side. to change the background. Yes? Okay. Yes? You click there and change. Okay. Hello. Hello. The port, this blue port, all our ports are in the forever loop inside the forever. Okay? Everyone put forever, not repeat. Put forever. Because I want it to happen over and over, okay? Okay? Then here, here, you go here and you set the rotation time. Set rotation time. You look for it, it's in motion.